G'day, my name's Simo and I'm a team leader uh, for week one of schoolies on the Gold Coast. So on probably Monday night, it was quite early in the night and my team and I were kind of doing the rounds around our, our hotel, we were looking after and knocking on doors and uh, we knocked on the door of uh, these two boys' room and um, we were greeted by one of the schoolies who um, had had a fair bit to drink. Immediately we began a great conversation and the schoolie mentioned to me that um, he had had a, a nasty situation with his, with his girlfriend and he was really unsure whether the relationship would continue because of the actions that had taken place. And he was really concerned and became quite emotional um, with my team. We'd been in the room for probably about 15 to 20 minutes and my team and I were probably about to head out and as I was leaving, I said goodbye to this one particular schoolie. And he looked at me and he said, Simo, thanks so much for coming tonight. I really think you've saved my life. And I asked him, because I was concerned, I said, what do you mean by that? Uh, and he mentioned how the past year had been really rough for him. And the situation with his girlfriend had really made him upset. And he felt like he wanted to uh, end his life. And he mentioned things that he wanted to fly off the balcony. Immediately, I instructed one of my team members to, um, to lock the balcony door and stand in front of the door. And, um, in that moment, um, this particular schoolie began to cry and break down and um, I was able to, to hold him uh, as he cried on my shoulder. We were able to calm him down and uh, we, we then referred the um, schoolie onto the appropriate services to get him the help that he needed. Um, and we were able to also calm the friends and um, settle, the, settle the room and make a really calming environment and provide a bit of comfort for them um, in the middle of a really traumatic situation. That night we were able to save a life. That night we were able to give that schoolie uh, his future back. Um, I think that's the heart behind the frogs. The heart is to see um, this young, amazing generation um, live to their fullness and experience all that life is um, and do it in a safe and responsible way. The following night we were able to catch up with the schoolie and his friends. Uh, we went over and we cooked dinner and hung out for about two hours and it was so amazing to see how um, the schoolie had improved from the night before um, and where he was feeling really low the night before and to see him now in such good spirits and feeling a lot better and after the help that he had received and play Uno you know, and just comfort the friends and just be there to be that positive peer influence that the Red Frogs are.